Another athlete portrayed by Reagan was Hall of Fame pitcher Grover Cleveland Alexander, whom he played in 1952's The Winning Team. The film glossed over the hard truth that Alexander was an alcoholic and instead implied that the legendary pitcher had a strange neurological disorder, which defied a cure by science, but was fixable by the undying love of his wife, played by Doris Day. In the climactic scene, Alexander battles a nasty case of wooziness to strike out the Yankees' Tony Lazeri with the bases loaded in Game 7. And the Cardinals go on to win the 1926 World Series, while Reagan's Alexander shares a tender post-game moment with his best gal.